All right, I didn't have OBS open at the time, but I just hit 73 fishing. Um, just AFK and get myself some Chromons while I do some university work. So yeah, that's why uh, that's why I'm here. I think I've caught myself a couple hundred so far. So I'm I'm actually quite like I know it's less AFK than Monkfish, but I think I prefer getting myself Chromons to Monkfish. All right, let's let's see if we're gonna get anything from this raid. Let's try not to die right at the end. Boom, boom, boom. Rip. Nothing for me. These guys, anything? Get anything? <laughs> uh, right. Never mind. What what did I get? Ooh, Adior and Plank. Literally straight after getting out the uh, out the raid, I got a friggin' uh, maze around them. Look at this. 488 death rooms. Like that. What is that? Okay, I was I was I was worried for a second there. I didn't put all of them in. Even then, that's wait what? All. There we go. All right. So about two hundred. I nearly got more from the maze random than the random than I did from the maze from the. Oh, I cannot speak. All right. Let's see. Anything? Nope. I didn't get anything. Oh, you got an ancestral hat. <laughs> <laughs> What what did I get? Dynamite gold ore. <laughs> I need a bigger hat. <laughs> I feel that's really weird that all of us have only got <laughs> one ancestral piece and it's all the hat. So uh yeah, we got our first Zora drop. It is the Serpentine Visage is not the best one, uh in inverted commas. Like a, a blowpipe would have been better but i am very happy getting the serpentine visage this what this will allow me to do is go with the serp helm which means i won't have to cure venom which means i'll be able to go on the standard spell book and i can use vulnerable vulnerable vulnerability vul, vul, vulnerability uh, and that'll make it so that zora's defense is 10 percent lower and it's it's just gonna be so nice having this uh, sadly, I'm not going to be able to use Void though, so I'm going to have to have bigger switches. But you know what? I, I I'll take that. I'm completely happy with that. There we go. Just uh, take that apart. Let's find where I put my uh, scales. Obviously, I don't need to put 16k in here, but I'm going to put 16k in there. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> I'm glad I got that. Uh, I think the only place I'm really going to use it is Zora, though. I can't think of where else I might use it, but either way, it's cool to it's cool to have. And finally, got something from Zora. I can't really say finally. I'm not that dry at all, but yeah, got something from Zora. Nice. Uh, I was thinking this was going to be a personal best, and then I started noodling towards the end. But there you go. It actually matched my personal best, so not bad at all. And I didn't actually need to eat. Uh, well, I did, but. I didn't have to eat much, so why did I? That was not worth the manta ray. But yeah, I'm since I've got these in my inventory, I'm gonna go just drink from my pool because I can do that now. Uh, the the gear upgrades from the like, oh, this is so good, dude, so good. Unfortunately, that was a very slow kill. I'm not sure what happened there, but that is 200 kill count at Zora. Pretty good drop, to be fair. Plus, it was a two kills in one inventory. Very boring looking inventory, though, from them. I think the other one I got, yeah, it's all Andrew Teleport, so there they are. Yeah, that is 200k here. Zora, that is as far as I'm going to go today. I'm going to go back to Slayer. Uh, as you may know, I had the Hellhound task. I decided I'm not going to do Cerberus because I don't feel like doing Cerberus right now, but I want to keep training Slayer, so I'm just going to kill the regular ones. Um, but yeah. Next, next, next Hellhounds task, I'll probably do server. No, no freaking way, dude. That's what? No, I'm not okay with this. I don't, I've already got one. I don't need this. <laughs> oh, that's upsetting. Okay, right, it's, it's my first duplicate. I can't get too upset about it, really. But yeah, that's kind of kind of disappointing, not going to lie. It would have been really nice to get either of the other two. I don't know why I'm even doing this kill. I'm probably not going to get it. But yeah, Pagasian Crystal on kill 178. 
that is my second, I think my first one was about 102 KC, so it's about 75 kills later, and 80 for cooking, just doing some AFKing while I edit a video, I can now cook anglerfish, nice, I do actually have some, I have 180 of them, I think I got these from Scottizo, but I don't think it's going to be worth cooking them right now, I'll probably burn a lot of them, uh, so I should probably wait before I cook them. Dude, dude. It's got a fucking eternal crystal. <laughs> oh, I apologize, I'm ill. I was just sat here eating my lunch, watching YouTube, because now that I've got the hang of this boss, it's actually so e like it's so easy. Oh, and I get my eternal crystal. That's so cool, dude. I, I, didn't, I wasn't expecting to get anything. I didn't have OBS open. I didn't have my headset plugged in. Because I got my crystal, like, my uh, my second occasion, like, not so long ago. So I wasn't expecting a crystal, like, even, like, in this task. But, Jesus, I, yeah, I got my eternal crystal. This is so cool. Um, <laughs> what am I, 191 KC, and I've got three crystals. Sadly, no primordials. I'm not going to complain, though. Because, uh, like, I've got the other two. Oh, right. Use the Eternal Crystal on the Infinity Boots. They can't be re-, re uh, actually, hang on. I forgot to do this last time, Uh, but yeah, let's do it this time. Infinity Boots have five magic attack bonus and five magic defense bonus. Let's make the Eternals and see what they have. Eternal Boots. I love how these look. Like, per like blue, purple is my, fa oh, my favorite colors, so they're just looking amazing. And let's see what the stats Alright, so I've gotten up 3 magic attack and defense, and up 5 in every other defense stat. That's so much better. Oh, that was so, ah, that's so cool, dude. <laughs> I didn't notice this, but I've just passed 200 kill count. You'd think I'd have noticed when I got the crystal, uh, since that was pretty much on 190-something kill count. But no, I completely forgot. That is 203 kill count. Alright, so yeah, as you can see in the chat, I forgot to take a wild pie with me when I went for my last trip to Serb, so I just came here to kill the regular ones to finish off the task, and there we go, that is the task completed. I got two crystals this task, so I cannot complain at all. Uh, he just asked me what my KC is, I can't actually remember, I think it's around 230. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty good, and I'm gonna go get a new task, I've... I kind of, I kind of want something. See, I want, I want Kraken so I can use my new boots, but I don't, I don't want Kraken because I want to actually play the game right now. So, yeah, let's go see what we're gonna get though. Let's grab my clap, clap gloves and go to Duradel. Right there we go. This is the first dark, dark, dark beasts task I've ever had. Uh, I know I said I wanted to actually play the game, and I'm fairly sure that these are the opposite of wanting to play the game. I'm fairly sure these are just very AFK and you sit there and kill them, but I'm excited to kill these. So yeah, hopefully the whole excitement of killing them will outweigh the fact that I think I'm just going to be sat uh, AFKing because I'm out of things to watch on YouTube right now. But yep, let's go kill these and see what they are like. Hey look, a death talisman. Imagine having to uh, get yourself to 90 Slayer before you could do Morning Zen Part part 2. What kind of nerd or what kind of noob would have to wait until they get this? I know the Hasta's long and all, but like, this is this attack range update is ridiculous. Look at this thing. It's basically a ranged weapon now. <laughs> this is actually so stupid. What the hell is that? Where's the loot gonna spawn? I'm actually curious now. Is it here or over here? It's over here. <laughs> Alright, we have a superior here. I don't think this attack can kill me. So I'm, I'm not bothering to dodge it since I was tabbed out. But yeah, let's see what we're gonna get. This is the first superior I've had in a very long time. 6,000 XP. Even just the XP is good. We got a totem middle and what looks like three coin drops, maybe even four. But yeah, that is, that was not a great drop. All right, we have another superior here and I was correct. It can't kill me. It just knocks me down to two HP and keeps me there. But yeah, let's, uh, it turns out I hit really inaccurately on these things. And I have to pray piety against this guy at least. 
Otherwise, it just it just doesn't work. Admittedly, I do need to repot, so uh, yeah, let's do that now. And this is an awkwardly long clip, because I'm not hitting anything. Come on, he's nearly dead. You can do it. Go on. Hit, please. There we go. 6,000 XP again. It's a crazy amount of XP. That is a lot of drops, but nothing incredibly good. Obviously, you can never come... Actually, you know what? I I'm going to take that. All of that stuff is actually all right. I cannot be upset about getting any of that. I have no banks. Ah, I've got the curbs put away. It's all good. After that Dark Beast task, this is a very, very, very quick and easy task. But let's see what we're going to get from this superior. Oh, it was the last kill of the task as well. Uh, I got a head. It's cool. I guess I'll take it. Nothing really special. What are we going to get from this one? Black Mask just before I leave? Yeah. And a Mithril Axe. Basically... Basically a black mask. Alright, I have a hard clue here. I think I got this from the uh, the Dark Beast Superior, so I I've had I could have uh, done it before and got one from the K4 task, but let's see what this is. Uh, nothing really special. Nature runes I cannot complain about though. Nature runes are always nice to see. Okay, so I have a superior here. Also, I decided to boost to try using Ice Barrage and this spell- oh, you dick. I'm sad I didn't right click on him. Am I still gonna get loot? It didn't look- nope, I'm not getting loot. Oh, what an asshole. At least I'm getting XP, I guess. But yeah, I didn't get anything from the- uh, anything- nothing from the superior. Why did that dick have to show up? What the hell? Don't, don't do that, by the way. That's just an asshole thing to do. And he hopped, so he didn't even get any of the XP from it. All he did was stop me from getting any drops. Ooh, I've been excited to get this task. 199 Dagonoth. Uh, the reason I've wanted to get this task is... I really want to try dry running at DK's. Right, I decided that I was going to... Uh, I'm going to go to DK's. But first, I want to try and smash out 92 Magic for Blood Barrage. That is because... Uh, if I like, I won that level anyway for stuff like God Wars Dungeon and Sire, so I feel like now's as good a time as any just to go smash it out. It'll only take like 40 minutes of stun alking. Okay, so uh, oh shoot, that was the wrong thing to alk, but yeah, I should be coming up on the level. There we go, 92 magic. Is it gonna say anything? No, it does not. Yeah, I think it only shows you the levels that you get for the spellbook that you're on. So, as I'm on the standard spellbook, I don't get anything for 92 magic, I don't think. Uh, nope, next one is 93. But yeah, uh, that is b b uh, Blood Barrage. Uh, sorry, I forgot what it was called for a second there. That is Blood Barrage. So, I'm going to have that for when I go to DK's, but it is currently... 10 minutes past midnight and I have a test tomorrow, so I'm not going to go to DK's right now. Oh hey, there we go, my first drop from Prime. Pretty early, to be fair, 17 kill count, not too bad. Also, that will have will have a couple uses, I think. It's not going to be the most useful thing in the world, but I am not going to complain about getting it. That is the Mud Battle Staff. Nice. Hey, look at that beautiful little dragon axe right there gonna have to drop my steel knives because there is no way I am leaving this on the ground. I do not want to risk it disappearing. There we go. That is uh, it's pretty cool. It's also a lot of uniques that I've got this trip. <laughs> Look at that. An uncut diamond. You do not see that very often at Oh, that. Okay. All right. I'm not going to complain. Not going to complain. It's nice to get a bearing. Uh, it's always, always nice to see it on the floor. It's just that's the one ring I already have. And is uh oh well, four point one mil, those things have gone up. I think when I was and when I was a main, those were like two two mil? Two point four I think when I quit. Okay then, I got a second berserker ring. Okay, nice. Alright, that is the end of the first act like well, I suppose proper Dagonoth uh DK King trip. I had to stop the other one a bit soon. But yeah, this is everything I got. I'm fairly sure I didn't, actually, I didn't think about it. I get... Nah, they're probably worth more than them. Oh. Uh, yeah, I forgot that you get twice as many on the Wildy Altar, so I thought these would probably be better. I probably should have brought bones back instead of these. Oh, well. I don't know why I brought the arrows. 
But yeah, these are all of the uniques that I got. Pretty cool. That's that's a unique. I've got those already, but a warrior ring would be just as useless, so I'm don't, not too worried. I'm really happy to get a dragon axe. I, I didn't have one yet. I've been using a rune axe. Uh, these I already have, but they're a good alk, and I these I don't have, but these are also a good alk. I don't think I need them for anything. But yeah, I cannot complain at all from that trip. Also, coals, steel, and u bars, they're always nice. Okay, so I've been doing a fair bit of Slayer recently, and I think I'm going to unlock th unlock some things. First, um, uh, I think what I'm going to get at the moment is just uh, is just sl uh, uh, Zar Slayer tasks, because even without a blowpipe, I can still do it fairly quickly, and even if I don't want to do a fight caves at the time, it's a free skip anyway, so it doesn't really make a difference getting that. I'll want it anyway eventually, and I think... Uh, I can't decide if I want to get boss tasks or myth dragons with noted bones, but I think I'm going to go boss tasks, because all that I really need to kill myth dragons for is... Well, I, I just like them because they're, they're a quick break. They get you some mithril bars, which I can use for darts. And chewed bones, which I need for the diary anyway. Look at this, dude. Look how beautiful this inventory looks right now. <laughs> this is uh, three Zora kills and a maze random in my inventory right here. Oh, it's it's just it's beautiful to see. 500k. <laughs> also, this. Maybe one of the best maze randoms I've ever had. Look at that, dude. 250 deaths, 500 chaos. How are you ever going to complain about that? But yeah, there you go. That is three Zora kills in one inventory. Whew, feels cool. Feels cool. Zolra! Come on. <laughs> Damn it. I don't need a second one of these. Well, uh, kind of completionist feel things. I kind of want to get both mutagens, so I do kind of want to keep this. But then again, twenty k, twenty thousand scales, dude. Uh, by the time I get a uh, a set both of the mutagens, I will definitely have a second one of these. So this is getting dismantled. But still, two sub visages, dude. Ugh. Actually, no, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to collect them for as long as I can. If if it gets to a point where I need scales, then I will dismantle it. But it's just going to go sit in my bank and be pretty, I think. Uh, I can't decide. You know what? Tell me what to do with it. I don't know what to do with this. I, do I just keep it or do I dismantle it? Dude, are you fucking kidding me? This is literally my first kill back here. I'm fairly sure this is the first kill back here after I got my last Zena. Is this a back to back? Did I just get did I just get back to back? I can't remember if I went I can't remember if I came back here after my last I think I may have just got back to back. Excuse me, what the what <laughs> Well that definitely makes up for the uh <laughs> going six hundred dry to start off with. Right. Let me just kill this guy, and then I'm gonna go and check what my KC is. Dude, that's... <laughs> okay, well, sadly, now instead of doing smithing, I really want to get myself some uh, crafting done. So, uh, <laughs> I guess that, that master clue is getting put off even longer. What are we gonna get here? Runite bolts. Delicious. Right, let's go see what my KC was. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> right, let's see what my KC was. 682 so let me think I, I i i killed i killed two while i was there didn't i so 681 was my kc let's go check my video and see where my last one was right it is it is tuesday right now and since last thursday this is what i have got from pvm oh yeah i said i would check my video also uh yeah, 681 was the KC I got that sec that fourth the fourth Zana the third Zana on sorry the second one I got on about 650 I didn't actually check it in the video but that's what I said so yeah it wasn't quite back to back but pretty damn close like it took me 600 to get my first one and then I got the next two in about 100 so and once I kill this demonic gorilla I may have started a ah now we'll be good.
once I kill this demonic gorilla, I should be getting, or I will be getting more specifically. Actually, no, I did start recording a bit early. Oh, and I get the debolt spec there. But yeah, there we go. That is 91 Slayer. I didn't mean to cut off it so quickly. Uh, oh, well. Uh, yeah, that means I now no longer need to uh, boost to kill Cerberus, which is very nice. Because uh, I would constantly forget to take the pies with me. But I don't need to worry about that anymore. Don't ask what I'm doing right now. I'm not sure. Oh, okay then. A, uh, a light frame. I don't actually know what the drop rate for that is. I think it's fairly rare, but... Ah, uh, well, uh, I do want, like, oh, I don't know if I've really said much about it, but I do like completionist-style things, and eventually, one day, if I'm still playing this game, I do want to try and get myself all the blisters, so I am not too worried about getting that. And the sooner I get it, the better. Also, if that is another, like, really rare drop, like, I'm just getting so lucky this week. It's amazing. Uh, just kind of, let's, let's just kind of hope it continues, to be honest. I I have just noticed that I have met, like gone past the six hour mark, so I'm probably gonna get logged out at some point. So I should probably, you know, like not be attacking a demonic gorilla. But fuck it. Uh, yeah. What world am I on? Oh no, I'll still be able to log in. Four four nine. Uh, right. Let's let's wait for this to happen. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Nice. Six hour log. That hasn't happened to me for a long time. It's it's nice to see, I'm not gonna lie. Though it does mean I'm a nerd. Uh, but I'm okay with that. And with that, that is the end of the video. As you heard in the clip where I got the Xenite, I was saying about smithing being put on hold. Uh, to explain that, it's because I've got in my bank currently a medium, a hard, and an elite clue scroll. Uh, and I also have the master that I got ages ago that requires me to get 83 smithing and after getting all of those clue scrolls dude get out dude you're in my way hang on oh, oh he's gone okay uh yeah so i've got all of those clue scrolls to do uh but because i've got them now i kind of had the choice of making a new clue scroll by going to watson or doing just doing the clue scroll and i feel like it's probably worth just doing the clue scroll, grinding out the 83 smithing, because I need it for the Lumbridge Elite Diaries anyway, and I would like to get that done so I don't need to use a Draymond staff. Uh, so smithing was going to be one of my goals for next week. Um, and now, as well as smithing, we've got crafting. So I've got a few clips for the next video, but not very much, so do expect there to be some content of smithing and crafting next video. Also a lot more Slayer, because I'm having a load of fun with Slayer right now. Uh, but yeah, that is the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed. That sounds really cheesy.